the reaction of the Minister of State for Petroleum Resources, Dr. Ibe Kachiku, to the lingering scarcity of fuel in some parts of the country, particularly the nation's capital, Abuja. The minister says the major cause of the scarcity of petrol is a shortfall in the supply of petroleum products. Dr. Kachiko explains that some of the private sector players involved in the importation of petroleum products had pushbacks, which meant that only the Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation is importing the product. But he assures Nigerians the steps are being taken to ensure that the queues disappear by the weekend. Dr. Kachiko's position contradicts that of the NNPC GMD, Dr. Mekanti Baru, who had earlier said that Nigeria has enough fuel in stock to satisfy the needs of Nigerians during the Yuletide. There was obviously um, um, some level of gap in terms of, in terms of volume. And that gap arises from the fact that NMPC is the only one who is importing a product currently. Uh, most of the people who were expected in the private sector to import product uh, were not able to bring in products. And some of them have pushed back on the days they are able to bring products into January. And so you, you have an NMPC rapidly trying to fill up um, the product requirement to 100% capacity basis. Now, luckily, there, there was enough, um, some good storage, um, which we are releasing right now. They are also um, um, making emergency, taking emergency steps to try and fill whatever gap that is in the December period. Post-January, post not so much of an issue because most of the uh, deliveries expected uh, should be coming in. I understand, in fact, for, for December, um, we're looking at uh, about four, four, four cargoes coming over the next few days, uh, but cumulatively uh, close to about 20, uh, 20 to 30 cargoes. Uh, so, so uh, is a timing issue? Timing because uh, some of the products you expected from private sector didn't come in, uh, but they're making every effort to try and quicken the process of delivery of the ones that they're expecting. Uh, and then in the interim, they're resourcing to what is in storage, and then um, Luckily, also, the refinery uh, in, um, in Cardona has been streamed, so that is beginning to produce right now, so that should also help uh, um, uh, the product situation. Additionally, Port Harcourt is also streaming. It is expected that uh, about the 12 to 14 uh, Port Harcourt, um, will be able to get into production. Once they do that, uh, there's about 2.1 million liters of production per day, and that should sufficiently provide a very big boost. Uh, so that's also been uh, fastened. The head of refineries here, and he's also focusing up on that. Now, what, is the, um, what are we expecting to see over the next one week? Um, the indications that I get from the reports that I get from my NPC is that quite frankly, over the next couple of days, uh, you should see a sliding down of any of those uh, sort of cues. It's already beginning to happen in Lagos. We expect that over the weekend to happen also, uh, also in Abuja.